Former police officer and CNN legal analyst Philip Holloway joining us now. Philip, thank you so much uh, for joining us. Police haven't released a sketch yet of, of the possible people involved. Why do you think that is? Well, first off, it's only been not even 24 hours or so. And so probably, you know, the guy was in surgery. They're going to need to do a thorough interview of him mm -hmm. as well as anybody else who might have seen this to get an accurate description yeah. so a sketch artist could make, the, make a sketch. But here's the thing. Eyewitness identification is notoriously unreliable in the criminal context, so they want to make sure that if they release a sketch, they make sure it's very, very accurate. Now, the, the home was actually ransacked uh, during this incident, which suggests that these four uh, allegedly teenagers were after goods. They wanted to steal things. Why go to a home where people are in it as opposed to a home that's unoccupied. This is becoming more and more common that what will happen is uh, someone will ri literally ring the doorbell and once you open it they just force their way in. This is something that is really really frightening. Uh, in all likelihood they watched these people come home. They had just returned home from a vacation to right. Florida or somewhere at the beach mm -hmm. and they they could have been watching them as they were arriving at home and, and seeing them unloading their valuables and they know that this is a a family that has small kids and they're probably distracted and they're easy to take advantage of. But what's interesting to me is if they were watching them then they would have known that they had been away. Why not go when they're away versus versus when they're home? Listen, I was on a community uh, a, a website for the community. A lot of people in the neighborhood uh, very scared. This happened Sunday night. These guys still on the loose. Philip, what do you do in this situation? You have people on the loose that ransacked a home, uh, put these, this couple in a terrifying situation. And, and what if someone comes to my door? and knocks on my door. How am I supposed to protect myself? If you don't know myself? them, don't answer the, don't answer the door. If it's yeah. somebody you don't know, we've tra we train our, t our children this. If you don't know the person at the door, mm -hmm. do not open it. Call for mommy or daddy, mm -hmm. or just, you know, we don't open the door. That's the first thing. But back to your original point, Yaz, I think that um, this has some earmarks of possibly some gang-related activity, because oftentimes, mm -hmm. to be admitted into a gang, you've got to commit some act of violence against Initiation. the person. Mm -hmm. And if you don't complete the task of terrorizing an individual, individual, you just burglarize an unoccupied house, for example, that's not going to meet the criteria that's necessary for you to get into that street gang. Quickly, so, uh, sorry. Well, I, just, I just want to know, if I put you in charge of this investigation right now, other than the fact that we know that these are four teenagers and we, we haven't seen the sketch, what are you doing to find these people? Well, you may have a tag number. Uh, I know where this street is, and it's not too far from here. Yeah, it's, some, it's actually yeah. just it's between downtown Atlanta and the Vinings area. There's a lot of major corridors. Somewhat that they of a transitional used, neighborhood, right? right? Yep, and they could have used a lot of different ways to travel. And so they're going to go and look for any surveillance uh, a video that might have been outside of an ATM, a bank, a mm -hmm. business, or something like that to see if they can see this car going by to try to identify the audience. Right. Quickly, uh, you said gang-related activity. Is, is there a, a propensity for a lot of gang-related activity in Atlanta? Is that, is that a big issue here? It's a huge problem, not it only is. in the metro Atlanta area, but nationwide, yes. Right. All right. Phil Holloway, thanks so much for joining us. We appreciate it. We My do, pleasure. We Thank do you. hope they catch these guys. All right. Come